Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. We are here with Arthur and Camp. We might as well go and do Abigail's quest since it's literally right here. I was thinking about just going over, fast traveling over to Emerald Ranch because we really need to hit up the fence. And then there's a trapper right here. But there was talk about a trapper being outside of Strawberry. We haven't, we haven't found it yet. Because I would really like to find that one. Over going back to this, to this area because it's kind of just really out of the way. It truly is. Maybe it's up in this area by Wallace Station. I don't think we've ever been to this Wallace Station, so that's another place that we need to, to look out for. Yeah, because it didn't come up. It has to be over in this area. The foggy, hazy area somewhere. Anyways, let's just... I think we should sleep first. The stew is currently being prepared. Okay, no biggie. Let's go to sleep first. And then we'll wake up and do Abigail's quest. It's right here. We might as well. Yeah? Hold on. There was one more thing I wanted to change or mess with with the outfit here. Which one? We have this one on. Okay. Let's see about the shirt. Because we have the collar, right? View. Doesn't look like we can modify it. Yeah, it doesn't seem like we can modify the... Unless I'm missing something. Modify. Here it is. Shirt collar. No, we can't... We can't mess with this. Look, see, we can put overpants with the boots, though. Let's put underpants for now. Yeah, we can't do anything with our shirt collar. That's fine. No biggie, no biggie. Because I was thinking the shirt collar just, it goes up, it looks tight. Looks like it's gonna be hot. Yeah? Good morning, Arthur. So, we did pretty well out of that train job, but the law showed up real fast. Too fast? It sure seemed that way to me. But anyway, we made it out. All right, well, I should be getting on. All right, Arthur. Let's take a little nap, huh? Shall we? Oh, chores are back up and ready to go. Since Arthur was a being a bad boy last episode, we might as well do some damn chores to make up for it. Yeah, I guess we'll go to noon. Because I wanted to go to at least the time where we can eat something. The stew. And then just take it from there. I can't really imagine what Abigail has for us, to be honest. I was just thinking something with John, but it may very well not be. What was that? Did you see that? Cigarettes? What is all this shit? Fake palmade? Is it just stuff left here? For Arthur to take? Okay. Well, let's go and I'm gonna go chop some wood. Eat some stew. Did you miss me, big man? <laughs> Hold on. Like the crops miss the sun when it's stuck behind a cloud, my boy. <laughs> I thought I was a gunner. I am sure. Yeah, but those stinky feet Morgan saved me. <laughs> well, we try to save each other when we can. Shame about Davy. Sure. It's always a shame. That it is. <laughs> that it is. He called us stinky feet Morgan. Mr. McGuire. <laughs> you missed me too, right, Arthur? You know, I'd forgotten just how needy you are. Anyway, I won't disturb you. All right, then. Who's that over there? Am I playing dominant? Oh, it's Javier. We can't even say anything to him. Alright. Let's go. It was a heap of trouble, but 
I got Mike out of jail. Oh, thank you, Arthur. So where is he? Still out round that way, looking for a peace offering and shit. Look at Dutch, huh? What the okay, fuck? I'll catch you later, then. Okay. A peace offering. All right, let me chop some wood, do some chores, and then we'll go eat and then call it Abigail. Done and freaking done. I want to eat some food and then we'll talk to Abigail. Oh, Pearson, you don't even have the food ready. Where are you? We have enough in the camp. Yeah, we have enough food. I gave you half my supply last time I came in here. That sucker don't even have the food done. Get this food going. Hey, there he is. You done yet? Thank you for all your work. Of course, Mr. Morgan. <laughs> He's not even close to being done. All right, Pearson. Let's go talk to Abigail then. I think we're going to miss food this time. Totally fine. We'll go talk to Abigail. See what's going on. Hi, Arthur. Come here a minute. What is it? <clears throat> Can I ask you a favor? Probably not. Very funny. Would you do something with Jack? He seems kind of down. All this upheaval can't have been easy on the poor kid. Why? Because I'm your preferred nursemaid? Because he likes you and, well, you know his father's useless. Okay. Thank you. She wants us to do something with Jack. <laughs> okay. Sure. What are we going to do with Jack? Go to Jack. It said uh, the quest was called A Fisher of Men. We're going to go fishing. Maybe. What's up? Charles? Hey, Charles? You okay? Always busy. Somebody has to do it. He's playing over by the horses. Hello, about the horses? Hold on, I'm talking to Charles. Well, don't let me disturb you. Just go Sounds take good. on It'd mean a lot to me. I will, I will. She said because John's fucking worthless. Please, <laughs> Arthur. The boy's been through a lot. I'm going, ma'am. I swear. Let me just talk Mr. to some people Swanson. on the way. Hello. You hey, ain't up, out man? of it again, are you? I resent the accusation, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> We're just making sure you're all right. Okay. We're going to eat before we talk to Jack, all right? Let me eat. I don't think I can eat. Oh, let me eat. Susan. Arthur. That stew looks delicious. It won't let us eat. I guess we gotta go right talk to Jack. Totally fine, totally fine. She said he's playing over by the horses. Oh, there he is. <laughs> because your father is useless. Oh, man, I can't wait she said that. Well... John's doing John, I guess. <laughs> hey, Jack. What you up to? Playing. Anything fun? I guess. You want to come fishing with me? Fishing? Sure. You're right. It's about time that you started to earn your cape. Okay. Good. Let's go get your pole then. Now, you do have a fishing pole, don't you? I sure do. Uncle Jose made me one. Good. Well, let's go get it then. Go catch us some fish. <laughs> yeah. This is awesome. <laughs> we still got this I'll fucking corpse on here. Lift you on when you're ready. You gonna be able to get on with this thing? <laughs> you're gonna fly. Wait for Jack. Jack, uh. <laughs> okay. Alright. Let's go then. Hold on. Let me, let me read Jack real quick. A fishing rod for catching fish. Who would have thought? Where are we going? Just down to the river near here. You shouldn't go too far from camp. Oh, okay. You feeling better? I know you was a little sick. Oh, I'm fine. You're a brave kid. So, just like you. Well, I don't know about brave. I ain't much of a kid no more. Well, your mama might disagree. Her and a few other women, I guess. What do you mean? Uh, 
I'm just talking silly. <laughs> Been a tough few weeks up in that snow. I like the snow. Yes, but not like that. When are we going back to the other camp? The one near Blackwater? Yeah. Well, we're not. This is our spot. For now, anyway. Why? I forgot a storybook there. We left so quick. Well, I'm sure someone can get you another storybook. Really? When? Hold on. Jack has asked for a Penny Dreadful book. Well, <laughs> we'll see. Got fish to catch first. Kyle, need to keep him away from the chickens. Look at these woods here, completely burnt down. Right, should we get this animal off of us? I don't want to get down yet. We're just yeah. running around with a decayed ass animal. Right fast, Uncle Arthur. <laughs> All right. Super fast. Faster, Uncle Arthur. I don't think I can. I'm pounding it. Come on, faster. <laughs> What's that? Sound like a. Oh, there was a big ass deer. Deer fucking flopping in the water. Jack's going to teach us fishing. All right. This looks as good a spot as any. Well, we're going to teach him, but we're going to learn too. Where should we stand, Uncle Arthur? Down by the shore. Come on, follow me. You I'm show me throat. where, Uncle Arthur. Let me just put this right here, right? I can't wait to get started. <laughs> just by the water there? <laughs> you mean? Yeah, right here. Oh, this is gonna be cool. We're gonna be fishing. We're gonna learn it. Now we can catch the legendary fish. Yeah, this right here. All right, see, this is what we do. We take some dynamite and we throw it right in the water. You can't fish without a pole. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, right here. Now first, we need some bait. To have a hole to use some bait cheese? You fucking going to catch fish with cheese? So here it is. Cheese is useful as hell, huh? We gotta catch fish with cheese. You can use corn bait, bread bait. Attract smaller fish such as redfin, pickerel, and perch. Smaller fish such as bullhead catfish, chain pickerel. Such as rock bass and bluegill cheese. Are you okay there, Uncle Arthur? I'm gonna yeah. use some cheese. Cheese? Smellier the better. Now, cast your line. Swing the rod back over your shoulder. And bring it forward in a smooth motion. Use your wrist, not your elbow. Okay. Oh, to pull the rod back, sure. And then release. Like that? That's it, good. All we do now, Jack, is wait for a fish to take the bait. How do I know when I've got a bite? Well, if you feel the tip of your fishing rod just twitching, don't yank it yet. That just means one's nibbling. But if you feel a hard tug, that's a fish going for the bait, so yank hard to hook it. Oh, we just gotta press that when we have a fish. This is a that. great fishing spot. Don't jinx it, kid. We haven't found nothing yet. Caught nothing. I think you've got a bite. Look. Fish on the line. Pull him in. How do we do that? Oh, to ruin the fish. Well, you it see is. See him fighting there, Jack? That's when you got to be careful. You, you'll break the line. Best to wear him out first before you try to reel him in. Okay. I think I got it. Look, Jack, it's a bluegill. It's almost as small as you. 
We should really throw these smaller ones back. Give them a chance to grow up a bit. Get back in there. I'll throw that bitch right in the sand. Can I take a break from fishing? I want to make something. Okay. Let's see. I'm gonna pick some of those red flowers. I'll be right back. Okay. You want me to follow you? I mean, we should keep an eye on. We should keep an eye on them, yeah. All right, go on fishing. <laughs> You're too far from the water's edge. Let's try to get another one. All right. Let's see what's biting there. <laughs> Jack, where'd he go? Oh, there he is. There, I got him. Got him. I see. I see. Well, seems like he's taking a rest now. I'm gonna try reeling him in, nice and steady. Well, there we go. Well, this is clearly the spot for bluegill. Fifteen ounce bluegill. Let's keep it, I guess. Sure. Are you told the Jack? This sure is boring, Uncle Arthur. <laughs> I know. Boring as hell. But then, something happens. And you can get food for days. Really? If you're lucky. But until then, you just sit and wait. And try not to worry. It's good Throw for some you. More. It's good for you? I guess. Huh. Hey, look at this. And what? This necklace I made. Necklace? For Mama. Sure. What a fine young man. Good In you. such complex circumstances. Arthur, isn't it? Arthur Morgan? Who are you? Yes. Arthur Morgan. Vanderlyn's most trusted associate. You've read the files. Typical case. Orphaned street kid seduced by that maniac's silver tongue and matures into a degenerate murderer. Agent Milton, Agent Ross, Pinkerton Detective Agency, seconded to the United States government. Nice to finally meet. We know a lot about you. Do you? You're a wanted man, Mr. Morgan. There's $5,000 for your head alone. $5,000 for me? Can I turn myself in? We want Vanderlyn. Old Dutch. I haven't seen him for months. That's so? Because I heard a guy fitting his description robbed a train belonging to Leviticus Cornwall up near Granite Pass. Oh, ain't that a little old-fashioned nowadays? Apparently not. Listen. This is my offer, Mr. Morgan. Bring in Vanderlyn. And you have my word, you won't swing. Oh, I ain't gonna swing anyways, Agent uh, Milton. You see, I haven't done anything wrong, aside from not play the games to your rules. Spare me the philosophy lesson. I've already heard it from Mac Callender. Mac Callender? He was pretty shot up by the time I got to him. So really, it was more of a mercy killing. Slow but merciful. <laughs> you enjoy being a rich man's toy, dear. I enjoy society, flaws and all. You people venerate savagery and you will die. Savagely, all of you. Oh, we're all gonna die, Agent. Some of us sooner than others. Good day, Mr. Morgan. Goodbye. Enjoy your fishing, kid, while you still can. <laughs> Who are they? No one to worry about, no one at all. Come on, let's pick up your things and get home. We're so close to camp, too. And... It's getting uh, late, Jack. Your mother would be worried. Let's head back. You ready, Jack? We only caught one fish, though. I don't I wanna... like it here anymore. It is quite scary here, Jack. This is right outside of camp. You know they Are gotta you know. Me back? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me brush Yuki real quick, all right? Oh, I can't. Let's go, girl. Come on, Jack. Oh, that's rough. Right in front of the kid. Enjoy the fishing while you can, kid. Damn. Why did you lie about where Uncle Dutch is? Because, well, because those are disagreeable men, and I don't want them to hurt him. What did they mean about Mac? Is he in jail? Uh, no, I don't uh, think so. I hope he's just fine where he is. Like I said, don't worry about them. The world is full of disagreeable men. That's why you got all of us to protect you from folk like them. Now, how about that necklace you made? You still got it, right? Yeah, I got it. Good. Well, did you like fishing? It was okay, I think. <laughs> it's a lot of waiting around. It is. <laughs> Mother efforts try to ruin the moment between us and Jack, man. Mac Calendar. Who is Mac Calendar? I don't know if we heard that name. Unless Mac Calendar. Maybe we have, actually. Because I remember reading the journal way back in the beginning, and a calendar name came up. Something calendar. So that the Mac Calendar is somebody that. Well, it's pretty obvious that Matt Calendar is probably somebody in the crew. And maybe we thought Mac was dead or something? Maybe he was one of the people that was supposed to be dead from Blackwater? Well, he's going now, yeah. Yeah. And that's rough. Right in front of Jack, though, to talk like that right in front of a kid. Damn. Hey, Jack, we might be able to do some hunting here, all right? Oh, I can't even pull my weapon out. Better be. That was rough, man. It was cool that we learned fishing, though. Been asking about it for a while, and it was pretty much... See, this is what I mean, that we're kind of almost locked behind tutorials, still. We've been playing this for... Well, quite a few many hours. Quite a few many episodes, too, and we're kind of still... It still feels like these quests are... Minor tutorials, in a way. Because things are kind of locked, still. There she is. There you are. How you boys getting on? Great. We caught a fish, and I made you this necklace. Ain't that pretty? Not the luckiest. Did you thank Uncle Arthur? No need. We had a good time. What's wrong? Nothing. Just met some folk. I better go speak with Dutch. Okay. Hey, you did real fine, kid. Thanks. That was really cool. We got a problem. What? I just met some guys out near the river. A fella named, uh, um, Milton and, uh, I don't remember the other fella's name. Ross. Milton and Ross. And? and they are employees of the Pinkerton Detective Agency. And they know about the train and they know we're here. Were you followed back here? No. They know we're near here. And they want you, Dutch. They offered me my freedom in exchange, they did. Why didn't you take it? <laughs> Very funny. Well, what do we do now? I say we do nothing. Just yet. They're just trying to scare us into doing something stupid. We have turned a corner. We survived. Them mountains. We just need to stay calm. Yeah, but I hate to say it, we might need to move. Pick up camp. Oh, we got a, we got a bronze medal. How? Just fishing. <laughs> Arthur does a favor for Abigail and takes Jack out on a fishing trip. Arrive at the river and catch a fish within one minute. Come on. You gotta savor the quests, alright? You gotta savor them. Can't just do it that quick. Hey, Dutch. I meant to tell you, Pinkerton's also said they caught up with Mac. 
Bastards finished him off. Oh, damn it. I assumed as much, but that is a real shame. Okay, well, let's talk more later. Okay, Arthur. Take it easy, Dutch. Can we play poker? There was a poker thing in camp. Look, we got more quests on the map here. One looks like John. There's Micah. John is in Valent. Oh, John did say he was getting something going in Valentine. We have AL here. That was that one quest, Albert. There's Black Bell over there, but we're not doing that until we get into this area here. We got Micah's, and Micah's is... Right here. But I wouldn't mind leaving Micah's until... Last, maybe? <laughs> Let's leave his quest until we have to do it. Does that make sense? <laughs> there he is. The Can you imagine why? Don't fight other man's battles, boy. And anyway, my family weren't even English. Whatever you say, King Arthur. <laughs> King Arthur. <laughs> why are you so obsessed with me being English anyway? See, I clearly touched a nerve. King Arthur. <laughs> well, at least you're working for once anyway. I thought she was about to grab us and pull us in, Susan. Well, I should get back to it. Whatever you say. All right, Sean. Listen, let me get up in there, Jose. Hey. You well? Get me in there. Take a bowl of stew. Well, we got some things to do. We can go to Strawberry again, which I would like to. And try to find a trapper, or we can just go over to Emerald Ranch because I need. What's up, kid? Not much. Well, I had fun fishing. Yeah, me too. So I lost Mama's thimble. I was playing with it and just lost it. Oh, okay. She's going to kill me. I don't think she'd care too much. It's only a thimble. Oh, no. She will kill me. Well, maybe I can find you another one. You can give it to her. Oh, that would be fine. Thanks, Arthur. How many more? Log Arthur, update. Jack gave us another. From a hanging? <laughs> Wait, shit. Jack has asked for a thimble. Sorry. Well, I suppose he'd do the same for you. Exactly. We're all in this together, Mr. Morgan. I know you know that. Of course, Miss Grimshaw. She always pulls us in. Listen, my food's getting cold here. <laughs> it really is. Oh, Pearson, delicious. It didn't fortify our health, though. Because our food got cold. Hey, Tilly. Tilly. Hey. Hey. You feeling going? more settled here now? Give me, yes. give me a second. This is a nice spot. All right. <laughs> Everyone's so fucking hungry. I want my coffee. Every time, Uncle. <laughs> Look at them all looking at Arthur. Chow line is getting full here. You guys hungry? <laughs> fucking great, man. We want to go over Strawberry. Do we want to make it over to the fence? It's going to be such a trek to make it over to the fence over there. Not really. I guess we can fast travel. That's what we'll do. Okay? How are Mr. You? Morgan. Good. I feel I made a Thanks bit again of a fool for taking of myself Jack again. Uh, Morgan here. We've all done it. And you saved my life again. Well, maybe one day you'll save mine. Or my soul. <laughs> yeah, I'd like that. Well, don't I'm make sure fun of me. To do. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, it wasn't a complete waste of time. I stole this from one of those awful men. You should have it. Sure. Well, thank you, but. <laughs> You were blind drunk. I was <laughs> drunk, but I never forget my manners. Be well, Mr. Morgan. All right, Rev. Will you be well, too? I'll try. I really Thanks. will. 
Take it easy, bro. We need to save him, man. There's got to be a way to help the Rev. Hey, Jack. Thanks again for coming fishing with me. I wish those mean men hadn't ruined it. Uh, yeah. Don't worry about them, okay? They did kind of ruin All it. Alright, well, I should be getting on. Okay. I think we learned the ways. We just, um, hold space bar, reel it in. When it gets what close. Do you, need, you okay? Damn, it got dark quick. Well, there it is. It's eight. Excuse okay, let's me, head to... to me. I ain't got ideas above my station. I just ain't doing that no more. We all just have to sing for our good. supper, miss. Sure, and singing's fine, but I'm done with that. And if you want me to leave, then that's fine, too. Well, I suppose I can discuss the matter with Dutch. Hello, Do whatever you goddamn please. <gasps> ideas above her station. She thinks we don't know her station. That horrendous old hag. How dare she. Hi. 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 <laughs> Everything hey. all right? Who does that woman think she is? Sometimes you just gotta humor her. Anyway, I won't disturb you. I don't think Abigail actually does, um... I'm not gonna say she doesn't do anything because she does, I'm sure. But I don't think Abigail is like the other ladies, per se, yeah? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm not really sure. Let's take some shotgun shells, rifle cartilages, sure. Cartridges, cartilages. And yeah, we'll just take. Evening. Evening. So, you ain't bored of this place yet? I guess not. Take it easy. I'm looting here. Pistol. Revolver. We got all types of shit here. We should go and play the, this poker game. Oh, it's locked now? It was just up. <laughs> what was that? The horse. What was that? I know it was a horse, but... Let's go play some poker. It's right here. We'll play some poker and then we'll fast travel over to the place. Have a nice evening. Hi there. Poker, anyone? Ah, but of course. But of course. <laughs> you know, this kind of thing is why nothing gets done around here. I think we know pretty much how to play poker. We've already read all this. Or at least skimmed through it, yeah? And we played it. No matter where or how money changes hands, the same basic principles apply. But I bust your ass, Strauss. Auto bet? Nah, we're gonna bet. Let's look at our cards. I am Ace calling and you. Two. Ooh. We're going to fucking bet big time here. We got two spades. Let's go with thirty-five cents. Now, don't get scared. Very good. Very good. <laughs> we got a good hand, I think. Community cards. Look at all these twos. We got three twos. We're going to go even higher. Let's go all in. 40 cents. There you go. Time to go for the throat. <laughs> Come on, Strauss. Bring it the fuck on. Oh, he's, he's going to keep on going. He's got no money left. <laughs> Time to go for the throat, huh? All in. Should we go all in? Fuck okay. it. Huh. Have a look at these. Not much of a hand. Huh. Want to swap? Did we whoop his these ass? These are definitely looking <laughs> how inconvenient. Well, that is certainly something. Okay. <laughs> gimme, gimme. See, this is more like it. Strauss has busted out. <laughs> Fuck out of here, Strauss. Oh, remember the old days, Arthur? Go get a loan. Me. You, Hosea, Dutch, playing poker till all hours. You on Dutch's knee most of the time, from what I remember. Oh, probably. Though mostly just so he could see my cards, I'm sure. <laughs> Long time ago now. Good moment, Susan. What we got? We got a five and a king. Give a king high. 
See, this is more like it. This is a game that I'm a little bit more good at compared to Five Finger Filet and Dominoes. I don't never played Dominoes my whole life, but we're learning. A poker? You working on this or are you falling asleep? I'm falling asleep here, ma'am. Now, don't get too worried. Show me. Uncle, come on in and get in. What is our cards? We got two fives. We got two fives. Okay, let's keep, keep going more. We'll do 50 cents, 40 cents. Let's have a little fun, shall we? Let's go. She's all in. Damn. We only got two fives, though. Call? I guess we'll call 32 okay. cents, sure. Okay. Here you go. Hmm. That stings. Well, ain't you looking smug? Okay, let's do this. Oh, sure. Oh, stroke of luck there. Yes. <laughs> Kicker decided the winner. Susan is busted out. See you later, Susan. That went a lot better. Well, that was a fun that game. So long. I done cleaned you both out. Two hands. Woo. Anybody else want to get whoop? Hello, <laughs> I really do like the poker. I think it's my favorite game so far. It's just something I'm more familiar with. The dominoes is fun. It's interesting. The five finger fillet is what it is. It's about a hand eye coordination type of thing. I'm pretty terrible at stuff like that. All right, let's fast travel out of here. We're going to go over to the fence. Hi, Hi Karen. You done whoop some ass, man. We'll go over to the fence, Emerald Ranch. How you holding up? Hell, we can go to Strawberry right here. Let's go to Emerald Ranch. And we should have went to Strawberry and looked for... Yeah, but there's no fence there. There's no fence at Strawberry, so... I want to get some more money. So, oh, whoa, Sean! I really wouldn't mind... Dropping off our legendary pelt as well. New journal update, we'll read it. Oh, look, Seamus is not fucking available. Damn it. Seamus, you're a fence, though. Why not right now? We're gonna have to wait. Oh, man. Open up. I guess we'll head over to... The trapper a while because now we're gonna have to come back here. We'll just head over to the trapper and then drop that stuff off first. Then we'll head back here. Maybe some time will pass. Made it to the trapper, but not that much time. That's really went off. It's two o'clock in the morning. Damn. No. Hey trapper. Got some stuff for you. That's seven cross for a while, eh? Good to see you. So, what do you have for me? You got all types of shit. Sell it to him. Okay, let's take a look at it. What do we got going on here? We have a lot of stuff in our inventory, man. Legendary coyote pelt. Sure, here you go. Boy, the things I can make with this. Make some good stuff. Perfect rabbit pelt. We should have donated that to Pearson. Yeah. Let me see what he has to buy. The Trevor can now use legendary Caillou Pelt for garments. Okay, that's fine. Let me buy something. All made to measure. So he has the items. There you Get go. Get some cover scent. I don't, want, I don't want a tomahawk. Reinforce equipment. What is this? Oh, the offhand. Maintenance required for weapons. That's fine. Yeah, but... Do we need... The bandit? We can do... We already got the Master Hunter one. Now we can do the Herbalist one. Which one do we have on? A horse and a saddle. It's not about speed. It's about knowing the land. 
Reinforced gun belts, increase ammo capacity for revolvers and pistols. Maybe we should do that. Weapons expert. Bandit. No. Gambler. No. Master hunter. We have the master hunter one, but we don't have it equipped. See, this black one that we have, because we changed the, the look of our outfit to the black one, does it... What the fuck is that one? Oh, that one's the explorer. We have on the explorer. Oh, no, we don't. What is the black one, though? I'll tell you this. Every now and then you hear of an animal that isn't like the others. Twice the size or smarter than a man. I kind of like that belt. Some of them even get named by the locals. And if you bring one in, ho oh, oh. Horseman gun belt? Sure. Clothing? <laughs> So much fucking crazy looking hats. We can't buy any of them. Mexicans best. make some fine trappers, you know. Yeah, we can't buy any. I got shit. an old war buddy down in Rio Bravo who's one of the best. You feed him tequila, he'll tell you about the time he saw the legendary trophy buck. White pronghorn. Whoa. Where would be? To be honest with you, I'm not. I don't think we'll wear any of these outfits. Maybe <laughs> for fun, possibly? <laughs> Every one of my garments Look at this fucking them. outfit. You just see Arthur wearing this stuff? You'll find them nowhere else. <laughs> Alright. Saddles. Perfect panther belt. Damn, so the trap was brought that the trapper has the best saddles, yeah? So we're gonna need Some panther, of the things folk beaver, bring me bear. To work with. Dead squirrels, cats full of buckshot, city folk, eh? Ten perfect snakes? Fucking hell. I don't even know if we've ever fully seen a snake. I mean, I know we got spooked off the horse a couple times, but I don't, I don't know if I've actually ever seen one. Items. Okay. We bought one thing for the trapper, but the thing is, the pistol holder that we got right now, I don't. I'm not sure what that one does. I can imagine it probably does less maintenance, yeah? You would think. But that one per se, I don't know. Maybe that's the one Micah gave us. Anyways, let's head on back. We got rid of the pelt. I'm going to keep that perfect. Rabbit pelt for now. We might be able to give it to Pearson for crafting. Yeah, I totally forgot. Let's head back to Emerald Ranch and see if we can sell stuff off the Seamus. It looks like we we still can't, but hopefully time does move and then we'll just look. There's a duck here. What is the big one for? It's just showing that it's in the area. Okay, that makes sense. Because a legendary would have a a crown. Anyways, let's head back to Seamus. Made it back to Seamus. Let's sell some shit. Let's sell some stuff. Hey, Seamus. I got a bunch of shit for you, sir. Welcome back, mister. All right, take a look. Oh, you got something for me? I sure the fuck do. Can be sold. Platinum chain necklace. Hmm. Now, where did you get this, I wonder? I have no idea. You wouldn't want to know, though. Jewelry? We probably got it on the train, to be honest. Can be sold. Platinum earring. Can be sold for cash, no crafting. Very nice. Shame to part with it, I bet. A gold tooth for one dollar? Do we keep this? It's a valuable gold tooth. Can be sold for cash. One dollar. Doesn't really look like it sells for much. What if it comes in handy? I know it sounds weird, but what if it does? Sold for cash? This must be an heirloom, huh? I'm still dumbfounded that you can't sell him cigarettes. You should be able to sell him cigarettes, yeah? Emerald ring. Take this up off the street, no doubt. Engraving belt buckle. Hmm. 
Come across a few of these myself. Coming to a stack of those, huh? Large jewelry bag. Whoa. Seamus, we got a lot of stuff here. There was one thing we needed to keep. It was like malachite or something. Was it not? Some kind of gem. Gold jointed bracelet. Can be sold. Can be used in crafting or sold. Silver earring can be if used in crafting. If you've been struggling oh, to sell a little something, give me a try. Did we sell anything that was crafting stuff? These two on the bottom. I don't think we did. Can be sold for cash. One dollar though. You can sell provisions to him. I may just snap one day soon. Only so long you can kick a dog. Been a pleasure doing business with you. <laughs> what? <laughs> you gonna kick a dog? Okay. <laughs> Keep this just between us now, won't you? Yep. I sure will, sir. Don't worry about that. We're gonna head over to... I guess we should just fast travel. Yeah, let's check out this fast travel thing here. We can use... The, what is this service over here? Oh, this motherfucker's not even here. Oh, he is here. Take a ride. St. Denis. We can go to St. Denis right here. We're going to go to Strawberry. Whoa. I hope she follows. Oh, she is. What is that? What does that mean? Our heart. We have a symbol that blinks from our heart, and it it's an arrow that points down. What does that mean? Are we cold or something? How do we? Player, let's see if we're we got we're cold or something. Fair. Temperature is fair. It's 39 degrees, so it, I mean, it is pretty cold. We're underweight again. Shit. Damn it. We need to eat more. It's because it's a bit brisk. I think that's what it is. It's a bit cold. Oh, man. Over. There's some areas cool, I want to check out before we do. Well, man, are we even able to go into this fucking place again? Let's walk around the city. I'm not going to pick up any quests in here. I just want to see if we, inter we can interact with people. Morning. Hey, easy there. Morning, right, man. Friend. I just want to say hi. hi. Because I want to go and see if we can find the trapper hey on the map. Morning. Look, there's something. Maybe it's something. Welcome to our fair city. Citizens, <laughs> enjoy yourselves. Visitors, Amuse yourselves. We are a simple mountain town for people who believe in a better, wiser, kinder America. <laughs> We've been inside the Welcome Center, yeah? Nice to see you. It's the one with the big bear in it. Yeah, there it is. I'm gonna go look at the jail. Welcome I wanna see if they strawberry, my friends. And to those that live here, stay here. We're a fine town for fine oh, people. A, an oasis of culture and civilization in the West. American ingenuity, European sophistication, fine architecture, and above all, good manners. All here in West Elizabeth. <laughs> 
Look, we can pick up bounties over here, even though we blew the fucking jail up. Look, there's still a hole here, though. Can we go in? No, we can't. Well, we have some stuff well, here. Not fully. Wait, because it's... Oh, it's, okay, the bounty is... He's pinging on the map like... Jesus Christ! Oh, God damn, are, you, are you okay? That don't look good. It's fine. I it ain't fine. I see off. you're bleeding. Uh, will you quit hassling me and leap? I ain't no gunslinger. Fucking hell, we bumped him. He's hurt. He ain't hurt no more. Damn it. Yes, <laughs> Give me another newspaper. Oh, we can't. We need to read that other one. We will. No <laughs> we done bumped the other guy and it ran off. Is this the house that Mike has shot up? Oh, uh, I guess there's nothing in there. Nothing to... Howdy. Morning, pardon. Decent you town you got here. That right? Well, I'll leave you to it. See you around. Can we not go in here? Doesn't look like it. Damn. Okay. There really isn't much going on in Strawberry here. It's a pretty small place. Mike came in here and shot it all up, though. Look, they're building this place and it's a house for rent. Okay, what we should do is see if we can find... You gonna get him? I think all their stuff. Okay, girl. Let's see if we can find... We'll just go in, I guess we'll go in this general area. We'll just see if we can find this damn trapper over here. What a coat on this beast. What are you on about? Oh, uh, we're running stuff over. Oh, we can go fishing right here probably. That's gonna be cool. We can just go fishing wherever the hell we want. I wanna catch a legendary fish. We'll be careful though. Yeah. On the way out of here, because I don't want to trigger Micah's quest, because I just don't want to do it right now. We'll do Micah's quest at some other point. Just... See if we can find the damn trapper somewhere. Rig Station. It was brought up that it was close to Rig Station. There's Fort Riggs. I don't think we've ever... Oh, yeah, we have been there. Have we? We went to Blackwater. At one quest. Well, either so, I want to go to this Wallace Station anyway. So we'll head up towards Wallace Station and see if it comes on the map. If it don't... Then, uh, you know. You can eat some food. Can we feed her Easy this? Easy, girl. You're okay. There you go. I think we just gonna had to run around Valentine, probably. Look, there's something here. We'll mark this. Yeah, let's just head on up. Let's make our way to Wallace Station. Since it's right next here, next to all the stuff that we explored, like Downs Ranch, but we never went to Wallace Station. And there's something here that we should check out. Morning. Every time we see a... Howdy. A random X. What is he doing? <laughs> Can we talk to this gentleman? Sir, what are you doing? See something? See that? Feller's dead down there. Must have gone off the cliff. Yep. Think he's from that uh, cabin up the way there. Poor bastard. Well, uh, guess I'll tell the sheriff when I get to town. Okay, I'm gonna go loot him first. You don't? I hope you don't mind. He's dead already, though. How are we gonna get down there? Let's just slide. Yuki, stay there. Damn, there's horses dead here and everything. Holy hell. A whole caravan might have... Ah, shit. <laughs> there he is. Let's loot him. Ride photograph. Flip. We can't read it. It's just a picture of a bride, though. Yeah, 
Yeah, we can't read it. And there's nothing on there. I guess we should put it away. So we got a picture of a bride here. Is there anything else around this area? See, look, there's a horse blinking up there. Wait, we can loot that horse. Look, there's a lockbox here. Letter, take letter. Wedding certificate. Let's read it. Certifies that James Payton and Mildred Barr were hereby united in holy matrimony in the state of West Elizabeth on this 18th day of May AD 1899. Flip it. Put it away. Put it away. Anything else? You got a wedding ring in there or something? Doesn't look like it. Nah, no, there's nothing else. Well, he was married to that lady. I wonder if we can find this Mildred. The horse over here was blinking. Maybe there's something on it that we can loot. No. And I don't think there's anything else. You think Arthur can make it up that? I don't think he can. I don't see anything else blinking. There's the wood people over there. Arthur, go ahead and climb it. You got this. Oof. What? what the hell? <laughs> he, he ain't making it up there. <laughs> you fucking making it up that shit. <laughs> Tumble in. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Hey, Yuki, thanks for saving me. Because I would have kept on trying to get up there and kept on falling down. Let's go to this Wallace Station now. It's right here. Well, that was interesting. Maybe we can find that lady at some point. Look, it's still, it's still an X on the map, but... We've already looted him. Oh, it's gone now. Okay. Easy peasy. Hey, partner. Mister. Hello. Hey, easy girl. Oh, there's a snake right there. Yeah. What are we even supposed to kill a snake with? Arm it? You see it's the snake? I seen it. We were just talking about not seeing a snake. There it is. Easy girl. It's here somewhere. Rattlesnake. Oh shit. Yeah, but Fucking hell, I can't study him. Easy now. A rattlesnake over here somewhere. Where the hell? Now it's gone. You're alright, girl. There's a squirrel. Easy girl. Hold on. I don't see it. You see it? I don't see this sucker. Should we get down and just fucking... We can throw some dynamite. <laughs> there it is. Now? There it is. Gotcha, mother effer. Just a snake. It won't hurt you. I don't think. Skin the rattlesnake.
What? Hold on. What kind of rattlesnake was that? A good snake skin. Yeah, but hold on here. The timber rattlesnake is native to Lamone, New Hanover, and parts of West Elizabeth. As carnivores, they prey on small birds, mice, rabbits, and lizards. A bow with small game arrows is considered to be the best weapon to wound or kill a snake of this size. Their skin can be used for crafting. Their meat can be used for a source of food. Damn it. It was probably a three star. That's okay. At least we know now. I was trying to look at it through the scope. Because I couldn't fuck it, I couldn't see it. And the horse kept shimmying. <laughs> Yuki kept shimmying scared and I just couldn't fucking couldn't get him. Fine. We need to go back to Brucey though. I would love Yuki so much and she has a good story. But I think the Arabians are so skittish. I know I've been talking about it for a while, and I want it to go back to Brucey at some point. Once we get Yuki maxed out, but... What is this on the ground here? Take a letter. Note from Jim. Hey, it's a note from Jim. Back in a few days, going to pick up Mildred from her mother's house. The new Mrs. Peyton. Best. What? I thought we've already dealt with this. What are you doing again? Best Jim. Where's the mother's house at, Jim? Because we need to give Mildred... Can we just leave it in the mailbox here? Let me in. That's terrible. Was Jim the one that died over there? Or was Jim just somebody else? I know it's... It's connecting with that fellow that died over there, but I feel like I didn't catch his name fully. We can't do anything else here. It's just a connection to that gentleman that died. It has to be. That has to be Jim. Back in a few days, but... Oh, that's terrible, man. Damn. We still have found no trapper. It's somewheres here. There's a stable here. It's somewheres around here. It's probably... See, because all this is explored. It's, it's not explored here, barely. Gotta be over in this area, then. We're gonna head to Wallace Station. It's right here. We got something here. Someone shooting stuff again? Oh, man. And this again. What's this guy? Last time was luck, huh? I'm feeling good today, Way. What do you say about up in the ante this time? Make it interesting. Okay. Why not? I'm feeling good too. Ha! Okay, my friend, let's do it. Hold on. I'm gonna take some Jolly Jacks. Just like the last time, okay? Who can put the most bottles? Just throw your gun and aim when you're ready. All right? <laughs> Shoot! Perfecto. Maldito. You just got I lucky. Thought, I thought it was just them ones. Feel better. Sure. Oh, that was damn pathetic. Oh, how about another round, huh? Race stakes. Again? Sure. Come on. Right, Could win it. real big. Aha. Uh -huh. That's a good call, amigo. All right. Real simple. First one to hit four flying birds wins. Stand near me, and as soon as they come out, it's anyone's shot. Be patient. Ah, there they go. Shoot! Oh, man. Stupid, stupid. <laughs> ah. Ah, oh, that's good shooting, I guess. Oh, okay, then, it partner. Is, okay? Hold still. Man of my word. Oh, there's that stand still. Sure. 
Better watch out next time. Just we'll not your day, huh? Yeah, I guess not. Guess I need more practice, huh? I cheated though, man. You're gonna have to get some Jolly Jacks. <laughs> Other said, stand still. <laughs> we can pick up all the birds. Let's go. Let's go to Wallace Station. We're gonna have about 75 dead birds on us if we pick them all up. We didn't make it far from the house. I want to check out this Wallace Station area before we end it. See what's going on there. We'll find the trapper in the area. It's not a big deal. Worst comes to worst, hell, we'll always go to Admiral Station if we have to. It really isn't that... It, it's just not out of, the, out of the way. Whoa. It's not really out of the way. The fence is right there anyway, so we can knock two birds out with one stone, basically. Yep. Look at this thing. A white deer. Wait. The deer use Springfields. Oh, white deer. Oh, we're out of ammo. We're out of. I think we're out of high velocity, though. That was a big block. I thought it was a white deer. It's only a two star. We'll just skin it. Just wait a second, girl. Should we put it on Yuki's back? Why not? Sure. Can we? Let's pick it up and just throw it on her <laughs> for now. <laughs> Yuki, you're out. You're not. It's just weird not having decaying animals on your back, all right? It's a big ass deer. Holy. Yeah. Okay. We're pretty close to the station, though. I think. I want to see what's going on here. So far, these stations have been interesting because every station that we came across, we found some kind of cigarette cards there. Bobbing and weaving. Hold on, it's got us going this way. Look at all the sheep. There it is. Wait. Is there a fence here, too? Oh, that's a shop. Is that a shop? Yeah, it's a shop. At Wallace Station. Let's go in. Hey, folks. Why, hello there, sir. Madam. Hey there. How do you do? How do you do? Anything for us here? Is a round? Look, there's stuff up here. There's cigarette card right there. We got premium cigarettes. Examine card. Isabel Standish. Lip. Ferris flowers and gems of beauty. Let's put it away. And then there was another one here. Examine. We're just leaving it out for us, huh? Millicent. Cigarettes. Ardines. Lip. Horse card six. Ardines. Is that the word? Sure. Maybe. Breeds of horses card set. Six. Wait, is this the train? Yeah, but how do we get to that shop? Hello there and welcome. No. Anything else around? So it doesn't seem like people care if we take cigarette cards. It just, they're just free for the taking. They're there. Pick them up. Oh, here, Yuki. Hey there. Don't think I've seen you in here before. You ain't never been here before. Let, Let me give you a tip. You don't grab this jerky here real quick, ain't gonna be none left. Jerky? Got my full stock in there. Let me see what you got. Hunting ammunition tonics. He's got clothing. Doesn't have guns, though. Outfits. The estate boss. The hat's pretty interesting. I just want a black hat. Author's version. The Roscoe. Look at this you one. You like what you see, my friend? That's pretty cool, actually. The Camulet. The Drover. 
Well, let's look at all that stuff. The drover. Oh, that's a black. Uh... You got your eye on a particular item, or uh... it's a black top there, though. It's only sixty-seven. Total price is ninety, but we're paying sixty-seven. Why? Why are we paying sixty-seven? I want this top here. Maybe not the rest of the outfit. So if we buy an outfit, can we take the top from it? Per se? Is it possible? This is not a bad outfit at all, really. It's actually pretty freaking cool. Might just wear you it for watch. a while. That train comes so close, it'll rattle this place like a tenement. Something bee. different. Yeah, let's take it. What kind is it? Suitable for hot temperatures. Let's buy it. Worth every single cent. The drover. The Roscoe. <laughs> the Roscoe's sick. <laughs> I like that too. The estate boss. That's... We need to do this with our boots. I think we need to put our boots back in... Back above our pants legs. I was looking at Arthur when he was... Listening to the, um... The gentleman in Strawberry. The mayor. And I felt like he really needs them. Look at Arthur, you kind of look like a bum, sir. The Drover, it, look at that yours. coat, though. There's a black coat for us. Not bad. I like it. It wasn't that much. 67? Sure. The estate boss is pretty sick. And so is the Roscoe. I'm liking the Drover, though. It's a nice change of pace. Let's look at more hats. We own the Drover. What I'm saying is, author's hat. How can we get author's hat in full black. There has to now be a I'm way. Constantly restocking that one. Big city hat. None of these. I just don't think. Gambler's hat. Oh. See, that's not bad. I see you can appreciate the finer things. Duster coat. So the same old coats here. I'm thinking that we need to go to shops. Yeah. Right. The coats are all the same. We go to shops and we buy these outfits. And maybe if we buy these outfits, we can use... See, because this looked... It looks really fucking sick. Just look at the coat. Folks around here have been raving about that. Yeah, we buy these outfits. And we are able to maybe... See, the Roscoe's... We want to buy the Roscoe? It's 72. Now, I'm constantly the Roscoe is pretty cool. That one. Just the color, though. I don't want to buy because I don't want to wear it right now. Let's leave. I think we're wearing the Drover now. Maybe. That should be. Are we good. wearing the Drover? We are wearing the Drover. Look at Arthur. Well, we know where the Roscoe is. It's at Emerald State or an Emerald Station. It's at this place. But well, we have a coat. Oh, I'm liking this coat. It's about as black as it can be, I think, yeah? If we hook up... Man, I gotta, I gotta test it. We gotta... Damn, I wish there was an inventory button. I can look at the inventory. No be made out here. Well, I just check him, huh? it out. I really like this outfit. I do. It looks pretty cool just like this. I know it's probably cooler if we just min-max outfits. Mismatch stuff because we're kind of creating it on our own. But this one just looks really cool. I really dig this jacket. Okay. Let me look at the map because... Wallace. Overlook. That's another place. Look, there's a solitary place here. I'm going to save here, okay? And when we come back next episode... Damn it, because look, if we change our outfit... Folks said I was a fool yeah, for taking on this store. Is it dark blue but or is I it like black? It's black. Quiet. I just picture us with our outfit that we're going to create that it's going to look. Yeah, this coat is going to have to be with our outfit. I'll be tending to you shortly. Hold on, I'm just, I'm strategizing here, sir. I'm looking at my outfit here. Yeah, I like it. We'll just get to the, we'll get to camp whenever we go back to camp. Yuki, how you doing? Whenever we go back to camp, we will... See if we can do this, because I don't know if we can. I'm not sure. We've never bought an outfit yet. 
This is the f maybe maybe we did buy an outfit when we first came into the game. I don't think this is the first outfit. But the only thing that the, the really what sold this outfit to me is the the black coat. I feel that once we get back to okay, we buy an outfit once we get back to our outfit area to change stuff up. I'm thinking, look at look at these clouds up here. What the hell? What the hell's going on? Is some kind of plague coming in? Plague of locusts, what's going on? Anyways, we get back to our outfit station. I'm hoping that we're able to put this coat, just the coat, onto something else. That would be really cool. It just it just goes to show that if that is the thing, if that does happen, then we need to start buying more of these outfits. Because not only are we getting just out the outfit as a whole, but we're also getting bits and pieces of it that we can change and put onto something else. It's really fucking badass. I love it. Anyways, next episode we are going to do probably some exploring and then make our way. The next quest I want to do is John's. It's right over here. It's not too far. I really want to find this damn trapper in the area, but we have a few things I want to check out before we head over to John. See, look, is this something? There's a little island here in the river. But this is something, you know, it's a house. This is something right here, Wallace Overlook. We'll definitely hit that place up next. Look, we were so close here. We killed coyotes here. So you're telling me that we probably went to Wallace Overlook before. I feel like we, I feel like this name is familiar. We went here. But we never just came down to this Wallace Station. If only we can get rid of this fog. I know, explore more, you'll get rid of the fog. But I kind of wish this fog was never a thing. We can easily just pinpoint areas to go to. It's okay. We will eventually get to it all and explore. But anyways, my friends, I'm out of here. Have a good one. Stay safe. See you next time. Take care.